how we got audio. Yes, we have. Right, hello everybody, welcome. Right. I know as you're probably tuning in to look at this either on the Twitch or the YouTube and you can see a scenario we did on the 7th of March 2022. But the reason why I'm bringing it back guys is because I've been in a conversation with the two people that have, um, well, one person who made this scenario and the other person who made the livery I've been chatting to. So I thought it'd be nice to um, bring it back to show what the scenario is actually meant to look like with the livery as well. So yeah, if it's your first time watching this video guys, this is a Tom Fresco scenario. He makes really good scenarios, I really enjoy his scenarios and everything. So. Yep, and I will also show you in this video guys the uh, reskin that, that you need as well. But yeah, if you enjoy my content guys, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, don't forget to hit the notification bell to notify when my videos and streams go live. Also feel free to hit the like button if you enjoy what you see, and feel free to hit the share button as well. But <clears throat> and I'll also put in the description down below guys the link to the Twitch and the Discord. And... Yeah, as I was saying that the Twitch, the Discord, train similar to Great Western Express. You need the Cafcart Circle for the 313 as well. And anything else, we will get into that shortly. So, we're looking at again, guys, the Heathrow Express... Express wow. Heathrow Express Replacement. So the description is, hello, new stock is being rolled out on the Heathrow Express services, but it has it has a few technical flaws. So in order to keep the trains running, older trains are being used as a replacement. So this six car first capital connect 314 from London Paddington to Hayes and Harlington, calling at all stations. So I thought I'd just flick through the pictures as well so you can see them as well. But the livery you need to get the 314 in the picture is this livery. The first Capital Connect Class 314 debranded is the one you need. Weirdly, I can't see the. There we go. So it's made by Blue Melon Z712. The description is this is a debranded no and de this is debranded no logos here. So this is the livery you need to run the Heathrow Express replacement scenario. So let's go and find the scenario and run it again. Apologies if you're seeing this for a second time guys, but I just wanted to bring it back so you guys could actually see it in action with the correct Delivery. So yeah, you can, well, to find the scenarios guys, you're going to the route you want, tools, scenario planner, we're going to scroll down and go to here for a replacement. So what you need is a class 314 from Cathcart Circle, the high speed train from Great Western Express, the class 166 from Great Western Express, the, the green uh, HST from Great Western Express, Class 66 from Great Western Express. The Class 387 from London Commuter. And the Class 66 again from Great Western Express. Sorry, my brain went blank. So it says here, I drive the Scott Rail Class 314 six car loaded from London Paddington Platform 7 to Hayes and Harlington Platform 5, making five passenger stops along the way. This is an off the rails scenario. So let's go and have a look, shall we? So yeah, apologies for the re-repeat of the scenario again, guys, but I just wanted to bring it back so I could show you guys what it looks like properly.
with the proper livery and everything like that. So there we go. And yeah, as I say guys, uh, coming soon, possibly today on the 8th, or possibly tomorrow on a 9th, I don't know yet, I'm going to be looking at another one of Tom Fresco's scenarios. So, yeah. And it's his latest one I will be looking at. Well, that was a good start. Game crash. <laughs> but I'm not going to go through all the blah 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 stuff again, guys. Um, yeah, let's say that was a game crash. Crash. Let's say when I load Train Sim World 2 back up, all I'm going to do is just hop back in the route. Hop to the scenario and we will go from there. So that's the first. Well, I don't know why, but Train Sim World lately seems to be like to crash a lot lately. I don't know why. So yeah, if you were just listening to the information guys and you got caught and you just saw uh, a picture of people watching TV with a spaceship flying around come up, yeah, that's because my game crashed. Sorry about that. <sighs> I don't know. So yeah, one thing guys, this game likes to uh, take its time to load up. Probably because I got like over 50 gigs worth of DLC on this game, so yeah, quite a lot. Right. Whoa, hello. There we go. So let's get on with that route that we were going to have a look at the scenario. So yeah, like I said before guys, to find your scenarios, just go into the route you want to use, tools, and then down to scenario planner. Right, Heathrow replacement. Try and load this up again, shall we? So yeah, yeah, sorry about that. Right, here we are, Heathrow Express. And it actually loaded in this time. Yay! Right, let's so unlock the doors at Paddington. Oh yeah, we need to do the thing, don't we? Okay, the doors have opened, let's put the AWS on as well. So there we go. So yeah, here's the livery you will need. Very nice livery actually. So yeah, this is the first Capital Connect livery. 
I say, if you've ever travelled on the East Coast Main Line between Peterborough and King's Cross or London St. Yeah, London St. Pancras and Bedford or London St. Pancras and Brighton. You would know this first cab to connect there very very well. So our first station stop is Acton Main Line. So on this scenario we've got Acton Main Line, Ealing Broadway, West Ealing, Hanwell, Southall and the final station stop of Hayes and Harlington. So let's get going and leave London Paddington behind. So yeah, thank you to the two people who have made the scenario and made the livery, which Tom Fresco made the livery and Apologies, I've just forgotten the name of the person who made the livery. Sorry about that, but I will show you at the end of the stream, guys, or the video, uh, the scenario and the livery again, so... Okay, we've got a yellow line coming up. That's a singular yellow. Okay, so what's the delay this time? Are we train chasing again? I think there might be. There's our HST that left London Paddington before us. Ah no, we're on a green now. One six six. That's a double yellow. The next one's a singular yellow. We must be train chasing then, we really must be.
We'll just coast for a bit. Let the unit in front of us get ahead a bit. Old Oak Common to the right hand side of us. So, you, <clears throat> so yeah, like I said, guys, there's going to be two versions of this uh, video up on the YouTube. One where I'm running this scenario before I found the livery, and well. Yeah, after. So one more running in in the three one four Scott Rail livery, and one more running it in the first coat of net three one four livery. So yeah, you're gonna get two di two different looks. Okay, we're coming up to Acton Mainline in 0 0.6 miles. And there goes that HST from earlier. Then we come to the Acton main line. Oh shit, I did not much put it into emergency. That was a mistake. <laughs> And it probably would help if I turn the throttle off as well. So, Acton Mainline. Oops. Why didn't we just tell that time? That's not good. So yeah, apologies for FPS loss here guys, but I'm just going to take a screenshot. So sorry for any any FPS loss there. So after this we will be going to Ealing Broadway, then West Ealing, and then Hanwell, and then South Hall, and then final stop, Hayes and Harlington. An express through on four bound throw. So, yeah, very well done to the person that made this livery. Very well done.
There goes a DB Schenker 66, should probably just caught the end of it there. Double yellow. Right, we are coming up to Evening Broadway. Let's try not to put the emergency brake on. Which I do seem to be very clever at doing. There we go, the Ealing Broadway. Let's go have a look on the map. Because I swear I'm train chasing. Yes, I am train chasing. Okay, there goes four 66s. Yeah, because the next, the train that I'm chasing has just where left West Ealing. So I think that's either a another three one four or a one six six in front of me. There goes the HST. Stealing. There goes the three eighty seven in the opposite direction. Don't know what it is, but I've noticed this in train simulator shush. I've noticed this in train simulator and train sim well two and train sim well probably. That the AI doesn't seem to always doesn't seem to have their pantographs up. But the player train does, which is very odd. Don't know how. To <clears throat> don't know how to fix that. Right, and we come to West Ealing. Other oh, DRA is up there. I was looking down here for the DRA because that's where it is in the 313, it's down here, but in the 314 it's up here. I was confused. <laughs> just 
having another scoop round the livery. This is very well done. Let's have a back screenshot. There we go. Oh, I just hate you, 314. Thanks for spoiling the shot. I was actually going to do a screenshot of the double there, but... Nope, that's not going to happen. Right. To the Hanwell now. So yeah, all we've got left on this journey now, guys, is Hanwell, South Hall, and Hazen Harlington. And that's it. So let's go. Thank you. It's because we've got a double yellow. Um, So we'll have a single a sing, sing in yellow. Wow. Singular. A sing, I'll get the words out in a minute. Singular yellow. And then we'll have a red. So we're coming into Hanwell. is off this time. There we go. Hanwell. Right, let's see if I can get that double shot before another train comes in and bolds it and um, destroys it all. There we go, we've got it. <coughs> and you know what, let's have a flyby on this before we get to the end. So, how well, let's do a flyby. While we're sat on the fence. Right, South Hall next. There we go. And there goes the train off into the distance. This will either be a singular yellow, a double yellow, or a singular yellow. We're coming up to. Seems to be a lot of AWS ping pings. Okay, it's singular yellow.
So the red must just be before South Hall then. Okay, now it's just gone to yellow. Okay, I think we've got a red at the end of South Hall Station. Oh, yellow now. <sighs> there we go. Six six. Right, and we come to South Hall. So the next station stop will be Hayes and Harlington. train will terminate. So, sorry if I just made anybody jump there with a horn, but it's a wake-up call. Do you know what? That would actually there. That would actually be a nice place to have a um, take off. And no, not like a plane either. Ah, I've gone the wrong side of the fence. There we go. Operation at this station. Please have your tickets ready for inspection. Thank you. Right, to Hayes and Harlington now in 1.7 miles, which is the final station stop of this journey. Thanks, 387. Don't you just love it guys, you try to be a train spotter sort of person and you're trying to film a train and then another train comes bearing in, it's like yeah, cheers! <laughs> There's a DB Shanky 66, which is just blurry. Right, 1.1 miles to Hazen Huntington, where the service terminates. You've now seen the scenario guys, how the scenario is meant to be played. Not like I had it in the wrong uh, livery the other day. And 
another 66 in EWS livery. English, Welsh and Scottish EWS stands for if you didn't know that. But when we get to Hayes and Harlington, we're going to go towards the end of the platform. Because annoyingly, when you try when you set up scenarios to go to Hayes and Harlington, they go, oh yeah, by the way, you uh, need to stop like, right at the top end of the platform. It's like, sorry, what? Come again? It's like, no, that's not right. And real training in real life would stop all the way down the platform. And a DB Schenker 66. So. Right, in we come to the Hayes and Harlington where we terminate on this service. Been a nice run actually doing this and the uh, correct livery. So, yeah, well done to the person who made this livery. Well done. Well, sugar, we're going to go into the buffers again. Did that last time. Did that in the last time I looked at this scenario. I went straight to the bloody buffers. <sighs> oh, because I was opening the doors on the wrong side yesterday. Oops. Right, that deserves a screenshot. I know people are going to moan. Oh, your train's in the buffers. Yes, I know. Can't do anything about that. Well, I could. I could reverse the train if I really wanted to, but... Uh, you know me. I can't be bothered. So yeah, this scenario in-game, guys, is called Heathrow Express in-game. Going from London Paddington to Hayes and Harlington. And we will lock those doors. There we go. So this time it took me 28 minutes and 20. Drove 10.71 miles. Nice. So let me just show you the information again guys of the scenario and the livery and then yeah i think i will leave this look at this livery by well, the scenario and livery here Right, so let's go back to Creators Club. Oh, wow, I've driven 1,133 miles on uh, Great Western Express. Wow. So. Let's have a look. So, subscriptions. So, the scenario we were doing was... Stop it. Was this one, Heathrow Express Replacement by Tom Fresco. It says, hello, new stock is being rolled out on the Heathrow Express services, but it has a few technical flaws. So in order to keep the trains running, older trains are being used as a replacement. Take this six car first cab to connect 314 from London Paddington to Hayes and Harlington, calling at all stations. So that's what it looks like. So to get that 313 livery, guys, you need this livery. Which is the first Capital Connect Class 314 debranded, made by Blue Melon Z712. This is a debranded, no logos here. 
So yeah, they're the two livery, uh, well, two liveries. <clears throat> so that's the scenario you need, which is Heathrow Express replacement. That's the livery you need. <clears throat> As I say, I will put in the comment description down below saying thank you to Blue Melon Z Seven One Two and Tom Fresco for their brilliant work. Sorry, I'm just going to have a look and see what else Blue Melon said. One, two. Ah, so we've done a DB Schenker Class 52. The first cab to connect 314. The DB Schenker Class 37. The Trans Pen on 1972 stock. The Northern 1972 stock. The VTG TE Tankers debranded. Network, Network South East Class 314. British Rail BR Class 37. Network South East Revised 52 and that's well what I can see so head over there guys give these two guys some support and yeah I will catch you guys in the next one so yeah, I will put links to my Twitch, Discord, Great Western Express, Class Third, I'm sorry, Cathcart Circle for the three one four, London Commuter for the three eight seven that's needed, and yeah. But yeah, if you've enjoyed this, guys, and you're watching this on YouTube, feel free to hit the subscribe button. Feel free to hit the notification bell so you're notified when my videos and streams go live. Feel free to hit the like button if you enjoyed what you see and feel free to hit the share button as well so we can get the video out there more. But yeah, I will catch you guys in the next Train Sim World 2 stream video, whatever. So stay safe guys, have a nice rest of the day, and I'll catch you in the next one.